relative atomic mass. Okay, now let's see what does it mean by relative atomic mass. Now from the words, uh, I think so we sh you should know that relative atomic mass means the relative mass of an atom. If we want to determine the relative mass of an object, we need to have a standard object or a standard reference uh, for us to compare, right? In chemistry, uh, the standard object or the standard reference uh, of this uh, relative mass is 1 over 12 of the mass of a carbon-12 atoms. We have a carbon-12 atoms, okay? And uh, we take or we define the mass of these carbon-12 atoms as 12 AMU. Now, AMU stands for uh, atomic mass unit. So we assume that the uh, carbon-12 atom, uh, the mass is 12 AMU, but this is not the reference. Uh, this is not the standard reference. The standard reference is 1 over 12 of the mass of these atoms. Now, since this atom, the mass is 12 AMU, so 1 over 12 of 12 AMU will be equal to 1 AMU, right? 1 over 12 of 12 AMU is 1 AMU. So 1 AMU is 1 over 12 of the mass of 1 carbon-12 atoms. As I told you just now, AMU stands for uh, atomic mass unit, eh? atomic mass units. Okay, so that is the standard reference eh, for the uh, relative mass of atom or the relative atomic mass. Eh? That is 1 over 12 of the uh, mass of carbon-12 atom, which is equal to 1 AMU. Eh? So 1 AMU is 1 over 12 of the mass of 1 carbon-12 atom. Uh, let's see these examples. Let's say we have an atom, nitrogen atom, eh, and the mass is 14 AMU. So what's the relative mass of this nitrogen atom? Uh, the answer is 14, eh? 14. Okay. Why? Because the because the mass of nitrogen is 14 AMU and 14 AMU is 14 times of 1 AMU, right? 14 times of 1 AMU. Eh? So this is the standard reference, right? So this 14 AMU is 14 times of this uh, standard reference and therefore the relative mass is 14. Eh? Another one. Oxygen, eh? the mass is 16 AMU and therefore the relative mass is uh, 16 because uh, this mass is 16 times greater than 1 AMU. Uh, this 1 AMU is the standard reference. Okay, sodium, uh, the mass is 23 AMU. So therefore uh, its relative mass is 23 eh? because this mass is 23 times greater than the standard reference uh, which is 1 AMU. Okay, so that's the meanings of relative atomic mass. Relative atomic mass is the relative mass of an atom. First, that's the first thing that you need to know. Is the relative mass of an atom. Okay, and seconds, uh, for every relative mass, we must have a standards of reference. We must have a standard object for us to compare, and that standards of reference is one over twelve of the mass of a carbon twelve atom, and this is equal to one atomic mass unit. That is called a one atomic mass unit. One over 12 of the mass of carbon-12 atom is called the uh, atomic mass unit. So by definition, relative atomic mass is the mass of one atom of an element compared to that one over 12 of the mass of an atoms of carbon-12 atom. Now this one over 12 of the mass of an atom of carbon-12 is one AMU. Okay, so this is equivalent to one AMU. Uh, so this is equal to 1 AMU. And uh, the relative atomic mass of carbon-12 is taken to be 12. Eh? So mathematically, we write this as the relative atomic mass of an element is equal to the mass of one atom divided by 1 over 12 of the mass of one carbon-12 atom. Again, this is equal to 1 AMU, right? 